it is the season to actually gift somebody special to you family and friends with gifts and i'm hoping you guys are going to gift somebody with amazing arabic oil perfumes so if smelling good is your thing hang out new things is your thing this video is definitely for you so please do keep on watching if you're interested in finding out more about today's video so yeah Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I was asked by one of my subscribers that I do a video of me trying on my oils and giving you guys a review about them so that it can make things easier for you guys to buy them. You know, like for the ones who don't know them, who are not even able to test them. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. But I just thought maybe I should like do a collection of my favorite oils and from the cheapest to the most expensive so i hope this video is going to be fun yeah i'm going to the city i've been invited by one of my suppliers to come and try a new product that they have so they like need um, a review from us exclusive buyers so i'm actually on my way there now come with me I'm guessing this is the new perfume. Man, five minutes, okay? I will complete her, then I will complete. Her. No problem? Okay. This is betava. This is this is one type of uh, grass which is found only in India. Its name is betava. It will not work. I like the patchouli. Yeah. I think also this one. Yeah. I love these three. It's not my type of. See, mommy. Immediately, it is not possible to recognize the fragrance. Mm -hmm. It will take some, some time to, to settle. Maybe I need to spray it somewhere. No problem. If you want to spray, you can spray it. No problem. Which one you need to spray? Maybe Just spray me. this one. Kashmir? Yes. And yeah. the, the one from India. I'll tell when I get home how it is. Okay. 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 So no. you said the price was 60k. Yeah, price is 60k. My comment on that is very expensive. Okay, no problem. Yes. Just a minute. Let me take your paper. Uh, this one. No problem. Okay. Have a seat and fill this one. something you see these tiny perfumes this one is even more expensive than the one I just tried see look how tiny this one is expensive 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 and this one too so tiny but okay i must say guys i am really obsessed with arabic oil perfumes hey and today i'm going to be showing you guys my little collection of some of the arabic oils that i use i actually don't have everything that i would recommend with me but this is something that i am using and i hope today's video will help somebody who doesn't know anything about arabic oil perfumes and is interested in them or wants to get one but they don't know which one or someone who's actually wondering um, which ones do I use so today you will get all the answers to that I've been obsessed with Arabic oil perfumes ever since I got to the Middle East and guys people around here smell like money you know they really do smell good and you can only look as good as you smell honey 
so let me not waste any more time and just get into this video before i forget please don't forget to like this video give a comment if you have any if ever you know somebody who's interested in arabic or perfumes or you would know someone who would actually like these perfumes please do share this video with them and i hope it will be of good help so yeah let's get into it i don't even know where to start guys but let me just start by um unboxing my gift thank you so much ajmal for this wonderful gift and thank you so much for recognizing me as an exclusive buyer so yeah let's get into it so this is the gift that i got it was nicely packaged guys but of course i just couldn't wait to open my gift and i opened it but this is it it's ember ember moss I hope it's gonna be clear guys Oops. um it's nicely packaged so it's secure inside of course it's not going to fall and this is how it looks and this is it on the inside and here's the perfume it smells so amazing and i was actually happy that i got this perfume because I currently do have two of these perfumes that I'm using and I've run out of another one that I was using so yeah I love it and thank you so much now I am going to show you guys these Arabic oil perfumes I'm sure you guys have seen a lot of these this is a 12 ml bottle and I usually get questions like um, is it the real deal are they diluted um, yeah these perfumes are not diluted guys they actually come in this big bottle what I actually do is pour these oils into these small bottles and I charge these 200 rands and this is a 12 ml bottle and they are as good as any other bottled perfume it just depends if you like it or not that's it so don't think just because this one doesn't come in a fancy bottle it's cheap or anything if you would like a nicely packaged bottle they do sell them i can get it for you and just pour the 12 ml into that bottle of course that bottle is not the same price as this one and it's not going to be 200 rands it could be 700 1000 upwards depending on how the bottle is so don't be deceived guys don't judge a book by its cover this is amazing as any other and i actually do have a sultan that comes in this bottle and a sultan that comes in another bottle um i think the sultan is like 12 ml 15 ml and it's the same size the only difference is the packaging and i do have um customers that actually buy a lot of perfumes like for instance a customer that can buy perfumes for 10 grand and they also buy these also this one can be convenient for you in terms of putting it in your bag because you cannot carry all the arabic oil perfumes that i sell in your bag most of them you have to like leave them on top of your dressing table or something so yeah if you want to try out arabic oil perfumes and you don't want to be spending a lot because you're not sure if you're going to like them or not i would suggest that you try you get this one and try them out i have a couple of scents for this one currently i have six or seven of them so please do order or buy it this is sultan see how small this bottle is um, it's what I was telling you guys about this is the same oil as the other one the only difference is the packaging this oil is quite popular with a lot of people they are familiar with Sultan I do recommend this oil for first-time buyers it really does smell amazing please forgive me guys um, I won't be going into details with the compounds or ingredients of all the perfumes but i do um list the ingredients on my fashion things page on instagram so you will know all the ingredients on each the problem is i have quite a number of oil perfumes that i want to show you guys and if i were to like mention all of them it will 
make this video long and i do not want to bore you guys with that what's important is i show you the perfumes so you can actually see what um i'm using and what i can recommend to you guys i was super excited when i was actually going to look for perfumes to find this one it has been sold out for the longest time i love it so much this is knuckle guys it is so amazing long lasting of course and unisex guys one thing that i need to tell you guys is that most arabic oil perfumes are unisex and there are very few that are categorized as male or female but most of them are just unisex it's just up to you which one you like because i don't want to label a perfume as um feminine or for females because that would like hinder the gents from buying that oil so i just wanted you to try it and you decide for yourself that you like it or not but i will mention some that i feel like are just feminine and not for men so yeah this oil is 650 guys very affordable very fancy and it smells amazing we are going to go into my all-time favorite perfume i'm sure everyone knows this um i even had a couple of people that always say each time i advertise perfume it feelings i sally of course i sally girl this perfume if you know you know hey if you know you know this perfume guys is so so amazing like it's meant to be a floral scent but not all floral scents are floral hey please never assume that there's vanilla in this perfume there's sandalwood there's musk and there's um what else i think lemon it's very strong long lasting you can wear this perfume wash your clothes iron them and it will still rise it will still rise again guys smells amazing guys and i would recommend it to you it used to be 350 but because people love it as much as i do i of course i had to like increase the price you know they say when the higher the demand the higher the price so i had to increase the price of this one so now it's currently 400 rand and it's 60 ml you will never be disappointed guys please do get this one this one I usually recommend this one for my brothers it is it smells so amazing it's oud al shams the name already screams oud it's oud and one thing i should tell you guys oud is best used in winter please please i beg do not use an oud, per an oud perfume in summer it's not made for summer it's made for winter in winter it it breathes out perfectly you know but in summer i think um most of my fellow africans use these oud perfumes in a wrong way that's why most people don't like arabic oud perfumes because they believe arabic oud perfumes are strong and they make you nauseous and like nj they irritate the hell out of you no i believe people put a lot like too much of it first of all and second they wear them in summer you do not wear oud in summer guys not unless maybe it's another type of oud that's not really oud oud but nje oud is meant for winter and then the floral scents and the other sweet fresh scents they are meant for summer i think the same goes for like normal french perfumes if i'm not mistaken i'm not an expert in perfumes guys i just like what i see and i sell what i I like that's it but that's my advice to you guys so yeah that's just it this is amazing and voila now i am actually going to show you guys a perfume that i actually started using when i was exposed to arabic oil perfumes and it happened that i was exposed to arabic oil perfumes before i even got here so this is the perfume guys this is hanin it smells so amazing <gasps> Ooh, 
guys first of all this perfume is strong very long lasting chili cedar wood in this there is um rose there's sandalwood there's yasmin and this is like a sweetish woody woodish woody oil perfume so i would actually recommend this to be a start for somebody who wants to experience arabic this is pure arabic to me with a little bit of twist by the sweetness of it but it's not really a sweet scent it's confusing guys and one thing that i should let you guys know is that you need to try arabic oil perfumes don't judge it by smelling it like that like opening it and smelling it you need to put it on your skin because when you smell it like that it definitely smells differently when you apply it on the skin so do not judge this scent or any other arabic oil by just smelling it you need to apply it on the skin so that you can really smell it because another thing that you should note once you put an arabic oil perfume on your skin it will smell differently after say sharing more yeah you know you have to like live it for a few minutes let it breathe let the air blow it and stuff and then within a few minutes you'll be able to tell the scent of the perfume and the base notes for this one is patchouli mask amber of course your girl likes the nicely packaged arabic oil perfumes i can definitely judge this book by its cover guys this is an amazing oil please do buy this one i almost forgot guys this oil is 750 this one is um 1200 so yeah and this is one of the nicely packaged um arabic oils and they are perfect for a gift for any loved one let me show you guys how it comes this is how it's packaged and your mom your father your brother your sister your husband your boyfriend will definitely love this as a gift it's really amazing and i love it and this is only for like 1200 guys so do get it for your love i would definitely recommend this one it's nicely packaged and it also smells just as amazing um one thing about me that i forgot to mention is that i mix my arabic oil perfumes or my perfumes i don't only just wear one so and i don't mix them in a way whereby this goes good with this i just mix all my favorites maybe i'd mix like three or two at a time not more than that I definitely recommend this this is also nice as a gift guys because one it's fancy and two the way it's packaged and it's so affordable as well and my baby's crying guys i'll be right back i think Luni was having a bad dream guys this one is my latest favorite my go-to scent this guys is very amazing it's badia it's badia oil and that's the um, perfume spray for it the perfume spray is 1600 and i haven't started selling this baby but next year it's definitely going to be available it smells amazing and it's much more stronger i prefer the oil as compared to the spray but it's always up to you as a buyer what you prefer some prefer the spray some prefer the oil i'm an oil lover and i love this oil and i forgot to also mention that oils guys are meant for the wrist and behind your ears so that's where you apply an oil but some oils that don't have color can actually be applied on your clothing and i'm going to show you guys before the end of this video just keep on watching this one is also new as well but there's a there's actually like a perfume for this one it's called banafsaj and this is banafsaj oil the spray is currently 950 and i'll be selling this one for 1400 it's going to be available in stock 
in January and I don't like the spray and I like the oil for this one and yeah we have another big baby over here this one is actually 2600 I recommend this one for my kings and my queens this is amazing and I actually mix these two together and you get uh, a bomb a bomb oh, these are the three perfumes that I usually take with me these are everything I'm not lying to y'all guys this combo yabulala another favorite is this oil Reham it is so sexy and elegant I love it so much guys it smells so amazing like if I could say I would say it is delicious it smells so nice and I would highly recommend it there's also another one that smells the same a very similar scent it's this one this one goes for 1000 and this one goes for 5000 this actually weighs five kilos guys so that also counts in making the oil so expensive but it's a lot inside and yeah this one is Hadhara they are both from the same company and they smell amazing I actually have like a number of oil perfumes from this company because I love them so much and their packaging is just everything so yeah I do highly recommend these these are the other perfumes that I was talking about that look the same as the one that was gifted to me this is incense wood and this is patchouli wood I love these so much and I use them in winter so I would highly recommend this to any wood lover or this to a gentleman because it's a scent that um, really does smell great for for the man this is also a fave this is Tariq Gold. There's also Tariq Black, which is for men, and Tariq Rose for anyone that loves rose. But this one is Tariq Gold, and it's like, it smells like vanilla. I don't know which other scent, but it is so, so nice. There's definitely vanilla in this one, and I would highly recommend it to somebody who doesn't like anything sweet and spicy. This one is definitely for you. Um, and this scent is like good in winter. It's good in summer and it's also good in winter. So I would highly recommend this as well. I actually thought um, I was going to show you guys maybe like 10 perfumes or so. But because I have different perfumes for winter and different perfumes for summer. It was, so it was kind of like hard for me to make a small collection for you guys. I have Aurum. This is a spray. And this is an oilish spray. So these two perfumes, for me, I feel like this one smells different than this one, but it's definitely one scent. This one comes if you're buying two of these and this being the third one. And that goes for 2500 But if you're buying only this one, it also comes individually. This one is 1250 So I highly recommend this, guys. If you like sweet scents this one is the one it's very nice if you love sweet scents and wood I am the perfect person to actually suggest any oil or perfume for you and one thing that I must let you guys know um, almost everyone that I've recommended which um, oil or perfume to use for starter has never regretted so i feel like i do choose the perfect one because of course i wouldn't want you to run away from me after buying a perfume so i definitely do make sure that i sell to you an oil that will make you come back you know what i mean so i will never disappoint you guys and also one thing that i usually do is um when someone says i would like to support or i'd love to buy but i don't know which one because i don't know how they smell and stuff i usually ask them okay what's your budget and when i ask that guys i'm not actually trying to corner you into 
buying a more pricey perfume or what i'm just trying to make things easy for me and for you because if you say your your budget is your budget is not more than 1200 i will i will actually collect my favorites or the best within that amount of money and then it's actually going to be easy for me to select it for you and if you're going to be able to to test them maybe you'll end up testing like five perfumes within that amount and it will make things easier for you instead of like smelling 30 perfumes and then you end up being confused and not knowing which one to choose so that actually does help we have a fave almost all my friends use this one and they love it but one thing i must tell you guys this is a different package it's not the old one um yeah now roses mask come in this package and this perfume goes for 2500 and when it's on special i sell it for 2200 and please note guys this oh this is a montel by the way most people are aware of montel please also note that montels don't montels are not the same price they all differ like for instance um intense cafe is actually 2800 and arabian night also is 2800 so they are not all the same price they actually differ this is one of the best sellers even here in the middle east and if you would love to try this and you feel like the 2200 is a bit steep for you i do have edition rose it also smells just as amazing the scent is so identical guys truly do recommend this one for you to try it out and it is so strong guys i swear to you when you're wearing this perfume people are going to ask you what are you wearing actually for all the arabic oil perfumes that's just how it is they are so different you cannot compare them to okay i don't want to be name shaming but you cannot just compare them to any other French perfumes because they are so different and they are not the same. I'm aware that there are some um, shops or companies that sell the small oils with the names of the popular French perfumes. That's not the same for Arabic oil perfumes. We don't have that. We don't do that. We just have bottles of the actual perfume. So that's it. I'm sorry I can't help when you come to me and say this is what you use what would I recommend I don't know how it smells not unless maybe I have it in my perfume collection I would be able to help you but in most cases the scents are not the same they are so different so they cannot compare and I cannot also I love this it's so nice it's a perfume and an oil so it's like a twin one and it also goes for 5,000 rands. It does smell Arabic. I actually promised you guys to show you how you actually apply an oil to your clothing. You let everything drip inside guys. Like you let everything drip inside. We are not applying the drops of this to our skin. We are actually wiping the bottle. We're actually wiping the stick, I mean, to the hands. So there I have, oh, this one is a little bit colored. So what you do is you rub it on your hands. And then if you're not wearing white or anything that can be stained, and then you just like to rub it. It will last you the whole day, even tomorrow, the next day. That's just how it is. So yeah, thank you so much, guys, for watching this video. I hope it was of good help and everything that I said actually made sense and helped anyone out there who would like to try out these Arabic oil perfumes. Um, these perfumes are found in the Middle East and they smell so, so amazing. And they actually have a range of perfumes and oils for everybody. Um, some oils come in a perfume form and some come in an oil form so it just depends on you what you prefer a spray or an oil and 
another thing that you'd note sometimes the spray smells a little bit different to the oil even if they share the same name like for instance there is um honey oil and honey spray for me the spray doesn't smell good for me and i don't even stock it so i always go for the oil but for some would say i have an allergy uh, but i love this one can i please have it in a spray i do get it for them so that's one thing that you should note and another thing that you should note is when you buy these oils please do not close them too tight because they are going to break and you will start thinking that maybe i sold you something that's broken or what you do not have to close them tightly because they have a glass there on the top and another thing not all oils are suitable for you to travel with them let's say maybe you are traveling or something you cannot carry all of them around with you because they are going to get damaged so it's always good to leave it on the dressing table another thing that i usually do is like when i apply let's say i really really want to smell good because i have a date or i'm going somewhere special so what i do is apply my lotion on the hand and then i open the oil and let few drops drop on the lotion on the hand and then i actually apply it on my whole body some people actually take um for those that use um lotions in a container they actually take the lotion and put few drops in it and then mix it and then the lotion stays perfumed and then each time you just want to apply that particular lotion you just use it either for special occasions or on a daily basis it just depends to you so that's how you can also apply it as well otherwise that is all um my arabic oil perfumes are available with my mother i will leave her details down below and they are always available but when they are not in stock you actually do order and then i ship it to swaziland and then you get it and then for my customers in south africa i usually ship through postnet and the charge is 100 rands so yeah um i'm still not able to ship international because some of these arabic or perfume contain alcohol and shipping companies do not want them so it's very difficult to ship them international but i hope one day i will be able to do so and i will let you guys know but for now thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like this video recommend it to any of your friends family members and yeah if they would be interested and if they would like to know more about these oils so yeah thank you so much guys be safe happy holidays i love you all